Alright, I'm back with another video. Um, so, I haven't been posting and been active for a while, but now I am back to posting every single day NBA and now UFC content. So, with my first video back, I wanted to talk about the next big fight, the next fight in the UFC, which is next Saturday, June 22nd. We got Hamzat Chemaev for, versus Robert Whittaker in a title eliminator fight. Obviously, the winner is going to face Drake Azupasis or after apparently Drake Azupasis Drake Azupasis fights Israel Adesanya. So right now the middleweight division is kind of a mess because Strickland just fought Duplasis in which a lot of people such as me believe that Strickland did win and you know Duplasis did win and now he's holding onto the belt. He hasn't fought since January and Strickland just beat Costa and now he's asking for a rematch. But you still have Adesanya, which is rumored that the UFC is going to book Adesanya and Duplessis for UFC 305 in Australia. But that has still not been announced. But on to the actual fight. So, this is a title eliminator fight. So, no matter if it's Drake as Duplessis or Israel Adesanya or Strickland, whoever, these two are fighting for who's next in line for the title shot. Obviously, Robert Whitaker has been a champion before. Hamza Tamayev is undefeated. And I'm pretty sure Hamza is favored right now. He is the betting favorite, which makes sense because he is undefeated. There is still a lot of hype around him. But there's also a lot of criticism around Tamayev because he hasn't been very active. And he just fought a pretty old wash Kamara Usman on 10-day notice. So... And with Robert Whitaker, obviously he's trying to get back to being a champion. He lost to Duplessis around this time last year. Then he beat Costa in a three-round fight. And now he's here fighting Chemaev. So this is a really good matchup. This is a really fun matchup. I'm really looking forward to this because Hamzad is actually one of my favorite fighters. And this does not seem like a really good matchup for Whitaker. This only plays in favor for Chemaev. If you look at Whitaker's last couple fights, sure, Duplessis has decent wrestling in, but Whitaker has not fought a lot of wrestlers. He's fought Costa. You know, he hasn't been fighting too many wrestlers, and now he's facing what one of, if not the best wrestler, wrestler definitely the best wrestler in the division in Shemaev. And this is a five-round five fight. Obviously, Hamza's never went five rounds before, and he doesn't have the best cardio. But I predict that Hamzat will finish him before the championship rounds. I really feel uh, Hamzat, you know, round two, round three submission, even maybe maybe even a finish, you know. Hamzat's striking has improved a lot. It's really good. And I think it's really underrated. So, obviously, Hamzat, he comes out right out the fight. He comes swinging full of energy, takedowns. And I think Hamzat's probably going to just sit on him for the first couple of rounds, try to get a submission, and just wear Whitaker out. Because I don't think Whitaker is used to fighting someone's ex explosive and just so unique like Chemaev. But at the same time, Whitaker is a vet, you know. He's been around for a while. And if anybody can beat Chemaev, it's Whitaker. Because I think Hamzat Mal's Duplessis. I think he out-wrestles and probably goes to the decision with Adesanya and wins. I think he beats Strickland. So I think, again, this is probably the best matchup and best opponent that has the best chance at beating Chemaev, but at the same time, it's also not a good matchup for Whitaker. So on to the title of the video, the reason I feel like Chemaev will finish Whitaker and Whitaker early, you know, maybe it does go round four. I doubt it goes five rounds. There's no way to sense in a decision. If Chemaev loses, Whitaker's going to get a TKO, but I really feel like Chemaev is going to finish or rather submission or finish. You just look at it, and Duplessis was able to finish Whitaker, I mean, Whitaker was pretty, pretty much saved by the bell in that first round versus Costa when he got that spinning head kick. Pretty much saved by the bell, and Costa would have won. So, Chemaev, he's full of energy. He's explosive right out the gate. I think he's going to take him down, try to submit him. And Whitaker's never faced a wrestler like Chemaev, and I think this is going to get Chemaev the title shot. Obviously, Chemaev doesn't have the best resume. I mean, he's fought Kamar Usman, who... It's still Usman, but 10-day notice, you know, not the same Usman that we know. 
He's fought Kevin Holland, Gilbert, Gilbert Burns. So he has some experience, but I think it doesn't really matter because his wrestling is so good that I feel like Whitaker will just not stand a chance against it. So yeah, a lot of pressure on Shemaev. Obviously, he's been having a lot of hype build around him. Some people are saying he's going to be the first triple champ. Crazy stuff. So a lot of pressure on him. I'm expecting him to win, to get a finish. And yeah, let me know what you guys think of this fight. I'm really excited for it. Who do you guys will win? Will it be a finish? Will it be a decision? Let me know. Again, new content every single day. Make sure you guys subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.